أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم اللهم صل وسلم على رسول الله Hello viewers welcome to my YouTube channel um, On today's um, episode we are going to discuss on palmistry like um, just the way we you see it on the title African palmistry uh, and basically we are going to discuss on the moon of um, Jupiter but before then, uh, before we go further uh, to discuss what the moon of Jupiter says on your palmistry based on African palmistry, uh, we are going to like intro, uh, introduce to people what all what palmistry is all about. So so many people think um, palmistry is all about um, lines in between your palm, and and that's all. Well, palmistry is not all about that. Um, palmistry has to do with um, your fingers, the way they look, your palm, the color and the shape, and so many other things uh, before you could um, like even say something about uh, somebody. So palmistry uh, has to do uh, with anything concerning the palm, not just the line in between your palm. So that's it so um where can we locate the moon of jupiter um, on our palm so like we all know the jupiter is located um right below your index finger that's where your um, moon of jupiter is located and and that spot the moon of jupiter uh like we will find out we will try to like say something um about the moon of jupiter and we all know moon of jupiter has to do with anything concerning wealth anything that has to do with education anything that has to do with um like leadership and even happiness you all find it um on the moon of jupiter not just the moon of jupiter but the moon of jupiter is one of the moon that talks about those um, things I just mentioned now. So we are going to take each um, like nine sign that may likely appear on your moon of Jupiter and what it says whenever you see those signs on your moon of Jupiter in your palm. Don't forget this African palmistry. So um, not everyone must have a sign on their moon of uh, Jupiter. No, some people may not even have any sign on it, but um, it's still, you can still say something about it even without the sign. So like for example, um, when you merge your fingers together and you find out this exactly spot, like was swollen or rise up this moon of jupiter was like it's it's swollen or rise up a little bit um that means that person will be like um will be someone that um will easily like know how to teach something like a teacher yes or, or, or a coach that means the person will have the knowledge to teach other people things they don't know. That's it. Uh, that is number one. And number two, most of those people, if they are to go into law, they will make a great career in studying law. And mostly, not even to make, uh, no, like, have a great or have the knowledge of, of law. No, they will even like be like create world from such um kind of um study so basically and another thing is that um when you measure your fingers together and you find out that the place is not swollen and you don't have any sign on it that is somehow not a good sign because such people you find out on anything they are to do, they must depend on someone. They can't do it alone. They need backup. 
they need someone to support them. They can do it great, but they cannot do it alone. They need someone who will support them. So that um, is a kind of not too good, but it's not like it's bad. So that's it. So this will be the first um, sign we are to discuss um, on this topic. Uh, we call this sign uh, the ring of Solomon. So whenever someone, whenever you see someone with this sign um, on their uh, palm, right at the spot of Moon of Jupiter, so we call it um, ring of Solomon. This sign signified or tell us um, that this person that has this sign on his moon of Jupiter is someone that um, has the gift of communication. Yes, the person know how to speak. Like he will be a good speaker. Like whenever he is saying something, you understand. Let, let me make an example, like a teacher. Yeah, you'll be a great teacher because whenever he's trying to tell you something or try to let you know something, um, you understand it easily and you understand what um, such people will say. So they are good in communication. That what um, the moon of, um, sorry, the sign of uh, Ring of Solomon told us whenever it has appears on the moon of Jupiter on someone's. So the second sign we are to discuss um, is the star. Yeah, so star is one of the greatest signs um, anyone we will wish to have on their um, Jupiter because it talks about, um, it talks about um, wealth, talks about leadership, talks about like fame so whenever you see someone with a um, star on the amount of jupiter that person like is trying to the star is trying to tell you that such people um will will acquire um a lot of wealth on yeah they will acquire a lot of wealth and they will like always have progress on well, um progress on anything like they want to achieve like whenever when anything they wish to to get they will work towards it and like achieve it yeah so it's one of the greatest um sign and such people you will, you will find out that they are straightforward people like when Anything they are to do, like they will do it straightforward. They don't have time to waste or to like hide their intention. Yeah, so they are very strict to anything they wish to get. And um, so such people, um, most of them, you find out they may likely be like leaders, it's either in your community household your anywhere you'll find them mostly they'll they will be like they are leaders yes so let us put it that way so that's it um and they are they will become famous in their society so having a star on your moon of jupiter is one of the greatest sign anyone will wish to have on their palm so um this trajet that's what we call this sign trajet so i will bet you anyone you see that has trajet on their jupiter one of jupiter just like the way you are seeing it um on this video hardly i have never seen anyone with this and the person is poor never it cannot even happen Anyone you see with tragedy on the amount of Jupiter, that person will be a wealthy person. So if you have a child or you yourself have a tragedy on your palm and is located at your moon of Jupiter, then I will say congratulations because definitely you must 
it's a must such people are wealthy so that's what tragedy tells us whenever it appears on the moon of jupiter so let's talk about um first sign when it appears on your uh, jupiter so such people are intelligent yes they are intelligent when it comes to books when it comes to understanding yeah they are intelligent and yeah they they also are wealthy and um, is one of the signs that talks about how they will like achieve things in life when it comes to wealth so it's one of the sign um good sign when it appears on your um palmistry but mostly um it may likely such people may likely inherit such business from family like the uh maybe if uh his parents or her parents are like business people such person may likely end up being a businessman and in that business definitely he will acquire um some wealth so and like i said it talks about um intelligent and also such person will be also famous like on in anything he he do like people will like to go towards him or he'll be, he'll be famous so it's one of the greatest signs um someone we like or uh, wish to have on their palmistry when it comes to um moon of jupiter so so our next sign is the iceland iceland no one will like to have this on his moon of jupiter no one will wish to have it because it's one of the bad sign someone will like have it because um such people you find them you find out that they lack anything wealth anything that will make someone to be happy in life like they will be disturbed when it comes to wealth communication uh, they will face a lot of difficulty in life so iceland is never a good sign in the month of jupiter just like the way we have more whenever you see a mall on your moon of jupiter it also means such people will it will not it will, things will not be easy for them like for them to have money to even feed themselves will be difficult because of the iceland or the mall that will appear in in the moon of jupiter so these two signs are never a good sign when it comes to um jupiter when reading the palm so i believe no one will, will like to have it on himself so let's go to the next sign and see what happened next so when um you have triangle on your jupiter um you are you are born to be a leader and also you can also go into business you you like you succeed in doing business and um you see anything you plan to do or venture into it you see um most of them will succeed yes in any kind of business you succeed in such business when you have um um triangle uh, on your moon of jupiter so it's a great sign and most um most of them may likely end up being a politician yes because um yeah they they are lucky people so having a triangle on your moon of jupiter is a great sign yeah so that's it then um we look 
to talk about the next sign, uh, which will be will be the S sign. Well, um, S sign. I love this. I wish to have this um on my palm because I just love it. I don't know why. When it comes to Jupiter, I wish to have one someday because you know um when it comes to palmistry, um I want you know I want people to understand the lines on your palm do change. Yes, they change time to time. So you may not have this sign now, but later at times goes on, you'll find out is either the line change or remove or add. Yes. Just in case you don't know, just monitor your <laughs> lines on your palm, then uh, one day I believe you gonna believe what I just said. Lines on your palm do change. And it doesn't take like maybe much uh, much time. No, mostly every year is either the sign may be removed or clean or added. The line that as in, was not on your palm, you find it there. So it's just as simple as ABC. <laughs> so um, the X on your palm. I like it. I love it because it talks about such people are great people. Such people can can be a, um, a coach. Yeah, they can coach, they can teach, and also they can be part of um, the administration, uh, administrative when it comes to like um, um, administrative. Yeah. So, and again, such people uh, are leaders, such people are intelligent, and such people are honored. Yes, when you have S on, on your Jup uh, Jupiter, you find out that people will respect you, people will honor you, and not anyone can like come to you and tell you what you don't like, like say rubbish to your face. No, because um, the person will fail somehow. So it's a very great sign, yes. And also most of them may not like money. They may not be that wealthy, but at least the money they are going to have will be enough for them to do one or two things in life so having x is one of my favorite things when it comes to um when it comes to um jupiter so let's talk about the last sign and um the last sign is um the um square so having square on the moon of jupiter such people are strong yes physically you'll find out such people are very strong and um they are good um like in understanding yeah they understand things quick fast so that means um such people will be intelligent too because for you to understand something fast um is has to do with knowledge so it's good is a good sign and um uh such people can also be a consultant because whenever they like give out advice if truly we, you walk towards the advice they gave you um you you achieve what you want to achieve um, honestly, they are very good in consulting um, issues. So, um, to, with this, we come to the end of this episode. Moon of Jupiter on palmistry, or let me say African palmistry. So, if you enjoy uh, the video, don't forget to 
subscribe and um the thumbs up and uh that by so doing that will like um, encourage us to or uh, let me say encourage me to do more <laughs> so um that's it for now um in our next video we'll try to like bring another moon in the other the moon of sun venus or anyone just to like the way we do this one thank you and god bless